All right, this is a pretty serious topic. We're going to get right into it. Kai Sinet, one of the biggest streamers out there, okay? Young, black, and gifted. He has been caught in the middle of some R-word allegations. Not that he's the perpetrator, but accused of being the facilitator. So let's get right into it. This girl named Joe Valicious made a Twitter thread saying that on January 1st, she was R-word by a complete stranger that she didn't know, one of Kai's friends. His name is Deej Gusak. And she said that she asked for help and it's not going anywhere, so she decided to go take it to social media. Pretty much she says that she was invited to a New Year's Eve party by Kai. <clears throat> and by the time she was going to leave, she was really drunk, so Kai just told her to go upstairs and sleep in the room. She says she felt safe. So while she was sleeping, this dude, Deej Gu, whatever, sat, walked into the room when she was asleep and brutally did some stuff to her, bro. She was bleeding. She woke up, saw him on top of her. The dude said that, oh, she was in his bed, and that's why he did what he did. Just, you know, real weird shit, bro. She texted Kai. She didn't get an answer. And the, 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 the dude, and then he tried to, you know, keep it a secret and pretend like nothing happened. She said that she asked him if he at least used protection, and he said, yes, it was a skin's condom. And uh, now, you know, she went to the hospital, had to start taking medications for STDs just in case, because, you know, bruh. And pretty much she's just been traumatized since then. Now, when she first said it, she said that she asked Kai if she knew who the person was. She described how he looked to him. She said that Kai didn't know who the person was. And so she went and was digging and found his Instagram and found a picture of him and Kai. So now it looks kind of shady on Kai's part. Like, are you trying to hide who this person is? You trying to, like, defend your friend or something? That's how it looked off of what she initially said, right? And so she ended up posting a full text message that stands between her and Kai. And you see, like in chronological order how the conversation went there's some time skips because uh, after she was telling him the information he apparently went to his legal team and went to go investigate himself like about like, the guy who it was which was a friend of his uh, she perceived him not answering quickly as if uh you know he was trying to cover for his friend but i don't really blame her all the way for that because you know if you just had something traumatic happen to you, you're you're in shock, you're distraught, you're trying to figure out what the fuck going on, bro. So, especially as a woman, bro, like, you know, you you if shit look fishy to you, you gonna think was well, you gonna think something's up. Now, I'm not saying that she should have accused him of facilitating it, which he kind of did in the text message, but then she walked that back um, respectfully. But I understand where she's coming from, but I also understand where Kyle's coming from too, because you could see in the text messages he's shock too put yourself in his shoes like if you if somebody tell you that your friend your close friend did something crazy like that i can't say the word because you know youtube they don't like that word you're gonna be like what the what the what the fuck are you talking about like in a way you know what i'm saying it's gonna be shocking to you you're gonna try to figure out what's going on you know in situations like that it can get pretty hectic bro like you gotta move correctly you gotta try your best to move correctly correctly even though it is a big emotional thing like it's big it's a shock there's a shock factor to it because look at him, big top influencer, right? Big top person on the internet. It's real easy to have all that come crashing down, burning down when it comes to like serious situations like this. It's a serious thing. In this video that she posted, she said, for everyone asking why I'm saying he didn't help me identify the person, it's because I sent him pictures of the person and I got no response about it until I found hard evidence that they knew each other. And even then, I still didn't get a name. His attorney told me the name just yesterday, three days after everything happened. I described him I described him every detail of this person. He told me he didn't know who it was. I don't care though, it's not about Kai. Like I said, it's about Digigu Digigu Sack. I'm sorry to Kai, but it's, I'm not the one who created this mess. I'm sorry to have accused him over text, knowing what happened to me, since that's just an assumption on my part, even though I've been shown absolutely no sympathy from his side. I sympathize with him. However, I will never defend a rapist. I don't care if they're my family. But yeah, so she I mean she did things right. Like she immediately went to the hospital, got a rape kit done, you know what I'm saying? And she showed proof that she got a rape kit done. She showed proof that it's on her Twitter. So, you know, I'd be, you know, if you put yourself in her shoes, if you was a girl and something crazy like that happened to you, you know, and, and you trying to you're distraught, bro, you're trying to get help from the person, the one person that you know, you know, and, and it seems like they're not really trying to help you or they're not really, you know, as res responsive, you're gonna feel the type of way, you know what I'm saying? Cause you you you're distraught, bro. You just fucking taking advantage of bro i do want to make a side note too yeah there are people who lie there are women who lie about you know situations like that there are people who weaponize their identity to you know 
get off for somebody. You know what I'm saying? Or ruin somebody's reputation. They do it all the time. That doesn't mean that you treat every person who comes out and says something as a liar. You know what I'm saying? Just like how we say it's not uh, it's not guilty to proven innocent. It's innocent to proven guilty. We don't go and don't go and take no sides. Like just hear what somebody say. You know, wait to see what happens, and then go from there. There are people that's literally sending this girl like death threats, like crazy shit, bro. Crazy. Which I'm not surprised though, because it's the internet. It's always gonna be anom anonymous accounts, bots, people that's not even real, bro. People with no pictures in they in their profile picture. No, they don't put their face online. They're gonna say crazy stuff, and it's tough. And that's you can't change that. There's nothing you do to change that. It's not right, but you can't do anything about it. All right, so Kai, after a couple of days, addressed it. On stream, it's 25 minutes long, we about to react to it, okay? We about to watch it live. And we're gonna see how his response was and get his side of the story. Oh, yo, yo, can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me? Are we good? Can y'all hear me? Is everything good? Hold on, let me, I'm, hold on, I gotta mute. I gotta mute all alerts. This is not no joke. This is a very serious matter. How's everybody doing today? How y'all doing? I ain't gonna lie. <clears throat> not, not that it's a... You know, you would think if you're talking about allegations, bro, you're gonna be so... How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? I'm not saying that you can't. You know, you can be how you want to be. But, listen, in certain situations, even if you don't feel something all the way, you have to... What the fuck? You have to, like, kind of, you know... Present yourself a certain way, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you don't need to do all the extra. You see me, I'm not being as how I normally am. Just, you know, acting crazy on the camera. You got to, you know, tone it down a little bit. Because, like he says, it's not a joking matter. It's something serious. But, you know what I'm saying? He young. You know, he probably ain't really been in no situations like that where it's like, this is serious shit for real. Get in here. Take it off sub only. Take it off sub only. Take it off sub only. Everybody is welcome in the chat. I feel like he's just nervous, bro. Everybody's free, everybody. I don't want it to make it look like I'm nothing is being everybody. Take it off sub only. I feel I feel relieved, bro. I feel relieved. I feel like I can be able to, you know, talk um whatever whatever I had to talk about. Okay? Hey thing too, this is live. It's not like a pre recorded video where you can go back and edit and try to cut up real nice. This is live. He talking about it live. So, you know, props to that too. Not being scared. Um, I'm in the UK right now. This my whole trip is canceled. Like everything, um, I had to stop content creating for this. This is very important. I don't play with this. Um, are you scared? Hell no, I'm not sc scared of what? I'm, I'm highly confident. Um, that's not what we're here to talk about. Okay, okay. All right. He definitely nervous because they keep repeating the same shit. Come on, bro. So let's begin. Um, I have I have points here to refer to. So I don't want you to think that shit is like you no know, on some like oh he's reading off a line. No, okay. Let me go ahead and say something real quick. Very important. I do not, under any circumstances, condone any sexual sexual activity without consent. I don't condone none of that. That shit is whack. I don't even play with the R word. I can't say it on Twitch. Therefore, because it's TOS. I do not play with that. That is not something I play with. Um, at, in any in any way, shape, or form, that shit is corny. I'm going to say it one more time. I do yep. not condone none of that. I do not allow any of that. It's very serious, bro. This topic, is. this is the most serious I've probably ever been in my life. It's the most serious I've ever been in my life, okay? This shit is no joke. Um, And I'm here to explain everything, okay? Your know, multiple blogs has posted shit. All right. Uh, first things first, okay? First things first, I want to go ahead and address everybody. Thanks to everybody who patiently waited to hear my to hear what I have to say and what I have to go go at what I have please don't tell me the internet is bad. <sighs> no, what happened to the internet, bro? Okay, we go, we go, we go, we go. Alright. So first things first, I wanna say thanks to everybody who waited patiently to hear what I have to say. You feel what I'm saying after this? Y'all can say whatever y'all want. I don't I don't care. I'm very you feel what I'm saying? First things first, okay? Let me go ahead and say something. Um I I I kinda First of all, I kind of found it very, uh, I've been going through, like, I've been, I'm getting dr dragged right now on social media. Dragged right now on social media. A lot of people forming opinions before I even got to speak. Let's dive. Yeah, a lot, there, a lot of people was dragging him. A lot of people was dragging him. And that was because of what I said earlier, where his apparent 
lack of answering or lack of immediately saying a name on the text messages, it looks suspect, especially to, especially like to, especially the people who've been through like traumatic situations like this, actual assault. So I was like, okay, why don't you immediately answer? Why don't you immediately answer? Why don't you immediately answer? You know, you know, a lot of people believe the, uh, that believe all women idea. I don't necessarily agree with that, but I don't necessarily agree with thinking that people are immediately lying either because no, if someone has an accusation, you listen to the accusation, you investigate is what it is. Um, I think a lot of those people that was dragging his name weren't really, they were understanding the girl's point of view, obviously, you know, but they weren't understanding his point of view where somebody's accusing someone that's your friend, that's your friend of doing something and you're a top, you know, top, top person that has a lot to lose. It's like, dang, like, this is crazy. Like, you don't understand the, the shock that comes into that. Now, some people are probably going to watch it be like, oh, who gives a fuck? It doesn't matter what he's going through. It's all about her. Da, 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 da. Okay, bro, stop, bro. Because when you approach it that way, you, nothing's going to get done. Okay? You can't approach situations that way. And that's why people who think like that do not need to be in positions of power. <laughs> because you're just going to be immediately reactive. And then when people do, the people that do lie come across you, they're going to get the way. Because you're, ob you're automatically trained to react. Okay? So... You know, but there are people who do try to defend their male friends when they're obviously like, you know, <laughs> criminals. You know what I'm saying? You're trying to cover for them. I've seen it all the time. So that's not to say that don't exist either. But you got to understand both sides. Right into it. First things first, I want to address how do I know this girl? Okay? As you guys know, New Year's Eve, I threw a party in New York City. The city that I'm from, threw a party back there. We went back there. Through a party, as you guys can see, I'm pretty sure you guys seen snaps, multiple videos, there's multiple photographers in there. Um, you feel what I'm saying? We took a whole bunch of pictures, videos. I'm having a, I'm having a blast. Mic in my hand. I'm running from the, I'm running everywhere. I'm having a blast. Everybody's having a good time. When you with KC3, one thing you going one thing you can say is that I make sure everybody's having a fun time. Everybody's having a good, right, right. The way I met that girl, or I started, I started talking to her, December thirty first, twenty twenty two, going into the new year of January first, twenty twenty three. Um, um, okay. People, people keep getting the narrative that like, uh, she, she, uh, kept saying like, uh, this is my friend, friend. She kept using the friend word a lot, right? Um, people keep thinking that like it was. If, if she's saying friend, they must have knew each other way back. No, that's not what it is. Also, I want to go ahead and say, Jovi, I'm not here to bash you or nothing. This is very serious. I'm this is the first thing put in my life. I'm not even gonna play it. Like, I've seen what you, I've seen the shit that you've been posting and crying and all that shit. I have sympathy for. Her. I'm not, I'm not here to say that. I'm not here to bash you in any type of way. Okay, let me put that shit first because mm. this shit. It's crazy, all right? So, the way I know her, I met her December um 30th. I mean, yeah, because I think about it, but somebody that you don't know for real, you met this person, and then she's saying that someone that you knew for a minute did all this stuff. You're obviously going to be confused at first. That's your immediate reaction, confusion. Like, what? What the fuck? What's going on? It is what it is, bro. I, I signed December 31st, okay? Right December 31st, I told her, to, I got the cotton right now. I told her to pull up to uh the party. Now, um, what we're going to do too, I've seen a lot of people reacting to his, him already. Like I saw Ethan Klein did. We're going to see what Ethan Klein said. Cause you know, Ethan Klein is a known fucking stupid piece of shit. So we're going to see what he got to say. And so, cause I want to see if he says something crazy or say something rational. Cause he used to be a rational person. Now he's no, a political pawn. The same way she got invited, everybody there got invited. Okay. People on the internet twisted it and was like, Oh, yeah, Kai should have been, like, you know, you feel what I'm saying? Like, you feel what I'm saying? Like, she should have been on her shit. No, the way she was invited is the way everybody was invited. Welcome. She, uh, she's in New York. I said, yo, New Year's Eve. Come, let's have a blast. You know, it's a, you feel what I'm saying? Music going. Everything was free. I had food, everything, right? That's how I know her. Um, it doesn't go any further. It doesn't go, uh. I didn't know who she was, though. I mean, she got a couple of followers on Instagram. She bad, bro. She bad. So, you know. You know how parties be. You want some bad bitches at the party. That's all it is, bro. Any farther than that, okay? Okay, one thing, one thing, okay? How do I know 
uh, the person being accused, Jiggy Jiggy, right? How do I know him? I know him. I never said he wasn't my friend. I know him. I, he went to high school with me. Um, and you know what I'm saying? He's a friend that I genuinely know. Okay. Yeah. Somebody That's another thing too. In the text message, he didn't say he didn't know that person. The only thing he was saying was, "I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure it out," which is referring to the whole situation. Obviously, that can look a type of way. That's why you have to be careful if you're ever in a situation like this and you're involved. You have to be very clear of what you say because people will be very quick to misconstrue what you what you're saying, especially as a man, because men are always the perpetrators. Men always da da da. So you have to be concise, okay? Yeah, I know personally, okay? All right, now, now. First things first, let me kick it off like this. I can't go too in deep, so you're probably wondering. Let me address everything that everybody probably was wondering. Why was not, why Kai wasn't replying? Why wasn't he texting back like this? And I don't blame y'all for asking me. Why wasn't Kai texting back like this? Why wasn't he helping? Because screenshots um, uh, came in. As soon as this was brought to my attention, chat. I didn't go nowhere else. When this shit was brought to my attention, I didn't go nowhere else but the police. Instantly. Mm. I went to my legal team. I went to the police. Yep. I'm not playing. I'm not being around. This is a serious topic. Let's go to the police. Let's figure this out. You feel what I'm saying? Um, A lot of people was like, yo, you need, uh, uh, he didn't help you. This, that, and the third. Bro, I went to the police instantly. My legal team, the reason why I did not reply is because my legal team told me, Kai, do not text anyone. Do not uh, post, uh, do not talk about the situation to anybody. Keep it to yourself. That's why I'm so relieved that I got the green light today to talk about stuff. Mm, okay? Probably because she, she put it to social media. That's why, bro. Mm. And then again, you feel what I'm saying? I'm not going against nobody. That's the reason why I couldn't tell, right? My team... I wonder if she went to the police herself. You know what I mean? I know she got the rape kit, but I wonder if she went to the authorities. Because, I don't know. That's strange. He told me, Kai, don't say nothing. Okay? Jovi. First things first, Jovi. I understand everything that's going on right now. I'm here to help to see what the fuck happened. <laughs> I've been accused of this being set up, being set up, and I knew what was going on. Negative, negative. That's disgusting. Negative. Like, bro, that's the reason why I'm kind of mad because I've been accused that I knew everything that was happening at the time. Negative. Okay, I don't know shit that went down that night. I wasn't there. Okay, I wasn't physically there. Okay, Jovi. Although my team contacted you and say and said that Kai. Is not able to talk at this time. Okay? They said that to you. You was aware that I was muted. But you still went to the internet. Mm -hmm. I'm not here to blame you. You got to the internet first. Mm -hmm. They uh, do their assumptions. My name got dragged. Okay? And it's fine. I gotta go. I, this is what this is what being at such a stature gonna come with. Okay? You was, you was, um, my team, what the hell I tell you? Yo. Kai is not able to talk right now. Don't, you feel what I'm saying? Uh, he, he, he Don't expect nothing from coming for him. He's not able to. This is all legal. Once this shit got brought to my attention, it is now an investigation. Mm -hmm. Okay? It is now an investigation. Yeah, that's exactly how you got to move, bro. Immediately. As soon as somebody says something, wait! Lawyers, help! <laughs> okay? <laughs> because it's just to cover your own ass, too, especially when you have a lot to lose. Because you could try to help somebody and it could easily be misconstrued into something else you know what i'm saying and you don't want to you know uh, contribute to like a witch hunt you don't want to contribute to letting somebody who's guilty get away with something too you know what i'm saying like you want to just get it boom straight point and blank center something happened to you go to the police go to the police investigate let the investigators do their job do everything that you need to do to help the investigation go through bro do you hear me okay this shit is serious. I gotta understand how serious this is, man. I'm not taking this for no game. Everything that was brought to my attention, my team reached out to her, said Kai's not able to talk. All right, so boom, I was I was literally muted at the time. I couldn't say nothing. Okay, let me go ahead and uh, I'll go to the next thing. Um, 
Oh, uh, what's it called? What's it called? What's it called? What's it called? My fault. My fault. My fault. Um, I, I just like her side of the story. Okay, let me go ahead and say this shit real quick. She called me the next day, right? Crying, bawling her eyes out. I'm talking about legit crying, gang. I'm hearing this story, and automatically, this is why I don't really blame the internet for reacting to how they reacted to, because automatically, I instantly believe, I instantly fell into it, I instantly believe, like, I'm, 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 I'm hearing it. I'm like, yo, this is crazy, bro. I, I, as soon as shit happened, I'm going to help you on the phone. This is the first phone call that we had together. Mm. I said, I will help you. I got you. You can see in the text messages, I said, yo, just talk to my team and see what happens, okay? I said, I will help you. It's not pre-recorded. Shut up. This is not pre-recorded. All right? <laughs> so, boom. I said that, right? As soon as I got the information, chat, I went straight to my friend, the person that you see getting posted. I said, bro, what the fuck am I hearing right now, gang? Y'all know I can't, bro. When you, bro, I have a select few of people that I call my friend for real, for real, bro. I addressed them. I said, yo, bro, what the fuck is this? When you see, you can see the text messages. When she sent the photo, you can see me react as in, it's, it's him. Mm -hmm. Like, I legit, I legit, I'm telling y'all what it is. I know him. So I'm t I went to him immediately. I said, yo, bro, what the fuck you got going on? What am I hearing right now, bro? You feel me? What am I hearing right now about... Shit that's going on. Chat. As soon as he heard her side of the story, I'm representing her, bro. She's hurt. She's hurt, bro. I don't play that. I went I went to her to him. I said her story. Complete shock. He was in complete shock. He don't know. I'm telling you my perspective. He was so confused on the things that she said. Legitimately confused on the things. That she said everything like that, right? Mm. So, as the one in between all this shit, I took a step back. I said, yo, Kyle, somebody's, there's two sides of the stories now, Kyle. Yeah, yeah, you know. But of course, as someone who was a, let's say, if, you know, somebody did do that, right? Their immediate reaction would be to act like they didn't do it. You know what I mean? Um... Assuming what she said is the truth, the, the things he was saying to her was, oh, just keep it a secret, da-da-da. You know, if, if someone questioned him, he's going to act like he didn't do it. You know, who's going to admit that they did that shit? You know what I mean? But of course, you know, now you're hearing two different stories, right? So what do you do? What do you do? What do you do when you hear two conflicting stories? And it's a very serious case, serious matter. You go to the legal. I'm out of this, bro. I'm sorry. If that happened to you, I'm very sorry. You know what I'm saying? I'm very, very sorry. Very sorry. If you lying, talking to the dude, you lying to me, bro, you cut off, bro, you tripping, like, you, bro, you did some crazy shit, bro, you need to throw that nigga in jail, okay? <laughs> but now, you know, it's two conflicting stories, bro, I'm not the police, I'm not Detective Benoit Blanc, okay, I'm not Batman, go to the police. Who are you gonna handle it with? The police, mm -hmm. okay? When she, when she, um, she asked for, um, in a screenshot... She asked for her name. She asked for his name automatically. I told my team. I said, "Yo, team, here's his name. Give it to her." That is the reason why she got it in the first place. Okay. That is the reason why she got it in the first place. And let me tell y'all something right now, all my viewers. Do not go to her profile, and do not harass this young lady, bro. Mm -hmm. Do not until facts are proved. Until Shit is shit, bro, like, and shit is going on, and the police are handling this. And this is why I didn't want to come to the internet, bro. This was never my intentions. I was just talking to the police and my, my legal team. When it hit the internet, I wake up here hours later. Remember, I'm five hours ahead. When I woke up to this shit, I said, what the fuck am I seeing on the internet right now? Okay? And I'm muted. My mom is calling me, bro. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sister, it's and that's the thing, like, bro, you're so quick to bring stuff to the internet. The police is already on it. You brought it to the internet, and then you made it seem like he set it up. Whole time, this man went to the police for you. So it's like, you know, it's tough. It's tough, but it's like, bro, we un you understand, like, something criminal happened to you.
And it's hard to say it for real. Not it's hard to say it, but you know, when you're in an emotional state, people aren't perfect, bro. That's the end of the day. People aren't perfect. But look at your actions. You brought it to the internet, and now you brought a lot of heat on yourself, too, and on him. Because now you open it up for the crazy trolls who are going to do what they're going to do, and then they're going to fucking harass you. They're going to send you those death threats like they tell you to kill yourself. Like, bro, bring it to the internet. Bring it, putting anything on the internet opens you up to harassment. Even making YouTube videos like, I'm making videos right now. That opens me up to people attacking me or whatever. So it's like, it's like, yo, why did you bring it to the internet for it? You said in the, th in the thing, oh, just nothing's being done. What do you mean nothing's being done? He brought it to the police. You have the person's name. Obviously, it's not going to be quick, 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 because, you know, there's a certain way you got to move and shit like this happen. I'm sorry, bro. All of me. It's not a joke, okay? You feel me? Nigga, look. So, um, I automatically said, yo, there's two sides of this. Let me go. Let me go ahead and take this up with the police. I'm not doing none of this, okay? Our shit is getting posted to the internet. Chat. I'm on the phone helping her. I'm on the phone trying to see what's right. Trying to see. I, I, I don't know. I'm so new to this, like, 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 justice shit that I'm trying to see what's going on, man. I legally couldn't talk, okay? I, I, I couldn't talk. They gave me the green light. That's why I'm so happy I'm able to go live right now, man. And I just want to make sure this shit is served. I want to make sure this shit is correct. Now, let me tell y'all something, though. Okay, two stories. There's two stories to this. All right, I'm gonna go. Ahead. I'm not defending anybody. I'm not defending anybody. I don't know what happened. I am in the same boat as my viewers. I'm in the same boat as y'all. I don't know what the fuck happened. Look at some of the comments, Kai. You need to stop doing but damage I'm control yourself. You're just building up an apology video. Go ahead and say something. The person that's associated with me, I knew this guy. I'm not defending him once again. I knew this guy for a very long time. We went on multiple trips. You feel what I'm saying? Never was this. He's not that type of person. I'm not saying shit didn't happen. I'm not saying none of that. I'm not defending nobody because, bro, the way she was crying to me on that phone, bro, I'm here to help. I'm here to help. I know how he looked. Scars on the face. Dreads. You feel me? That's for the law. If That's for the law to handle, though. That's none of y'all business at all. None of y'all business at all, okay? Now, I'm here to help. I'm, I'm here to see what the facts is. Because whatever the facts is, bro, I swear to God, I'm bro, I haven't spoke to him since it happened. I've stepped aside from him and her mm -hmm. since it happened, mm -hmm. okay? The last time I spoke to him was when in, I, I, I said, yo, bro, I need your name. Gave it to me instantly. Gave me his name instantly. That's the reason why she got it. Gave me the name instantly. Everything was processed instantly. You feel me? That was the last time. If he knew it was from high school. He didn't know his last name or something? Hmm. Maybe he wanted him to spell it or something. I don't know. Ever since then, I've completely stepped back. The only person who I've been in conversation with was the law. My lawyers. My legal team. Nobody else! Nobody else whatsoever. Okay? All right. Someone said you're a snitch. Wow. Boom. After that, got his name, gave it to my team, they gave it to her. That's the reason why she got it, okay? Um, they said, why also, Why'd you need your friend's name? Yeah, why'd you need your friend's name? You didn't know his last name? Or you didn't know how to spell it? Oh. Um, let me go ahead and say something real quick. Uh, I seen her uh, go to, you know, spread awareness on what's going on on a Twitch little interview yesterday. I just wish that, I just wish that she... I didn't see that. I'm going to have to look for that now. I didn't see that. Busted me in this process of helping her that she didn't jump the gun on the internet. Because, bro, when things get to the internet, a lot of shit gets formulated. But I don't blame her. I don't know what she's going through mentally. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know what she's going through mentally. All I can promise to, to her is that I will make sure shit is right. I will make sure. I don't know what happened. I just see, I'm just hearing two sides of the stories. I don't know what happened. I'm here to figure it out. Again, with the law. I'm not here 
to go on the internet. You know what I'm saying? And I have people dragging my name, bro. They're dragging it, bro. I, okay, I keep seeing people saying I didn't reply. The reason why I didn't reply is because I wasn't legally able to. My team told me no. That's why I'm replying now. Please be on the same page as me. Okay? Please. I'm, 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 in, I'm trying to salute. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, thing. She used the term setup, you know, um, which is what got me, like, what, what, like, hurt. It hurt me, bro, because I don't play like that, bro. Set up, like, I don't play like that. But I seen that she retracted yesterday, and she was saying shit like, she's not even trying to blame me, and this and the third, and all of that, and shit like that. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, because the way she framed it, right, the way she talked about it, she made it seem like he specifically invited her. Come to the party, and it's, he sent his friend to go do something to her. Oh, because he's the only one who knew that she was in that room. <sighs> you know, but from what he said, everyone got invited to the party the same way. It's not about you specifically. And it's not like they were talking or chopping it up before that day. Wow. You know what I mean? So kind of just, it don't. Mm. You gotta go with me. Okay, so boom. All right. Um, let me see what else. Um, uh, the reason why I was kind of disappointed in the internet thing was because um, I have it right here. Um, it it not only shatters my name falsely. I'm, I'm in a new year. I put everything aside. I have a subathon next month. Fuck that. Everything's hey, aside right now. Yes, yeah, so what next until month? Until I feel like I'm on a good track until solving what the fuck happened. Everything's aside. I'm not even playing no more, bro. This is serious. My name is now in the mix, okay? The new year just started. I don't, this is the things I don't want to see happen, man. This is the things I don't want to see happen. Now, chat, I'm going to go ahead and tell you this right here. I wish. I wish I can tell you how things played out on my perspective, how things went along in my perspective. But you guys have to trust me on this when I say trust me. I cannot talk about anything else unless the police is involved. And I refuse to talk about anything else unless the police is involved. I haven't spoken to her. I haven't spoken to him. I haven't spoken to her. I haven't spoken to him. His whole image is fucked up right now, gang. He's everywhere. Every blog, everybody knows about this. He's everywhere. I'm telling y'all to trust me, bro. Whatever happens, bro. Whatever happens, I'm going to make sure y'all are updated if I can. Okay? I don't play like this. All right? I don't play like this. If he's in the wrong, he's in the wrong. You're done. You're done. If she's in the wrong, she's in the, in some way she's in the wrong. And some, you feel what I'm saying? Everybody would know. At a point of time, the whatever's in the dark going to come out to the light. I've been praying. I've been praying. That's a I fact. That's a fact. Composure. It's a lot for me, bro. It's a lot. I got a lot to focus on. <sighs> feel me? Like, it's a lot for me. You feel me? So, everybody standing in my name right now and saying shit. Y'all could carry the narrative that y'all want. But when, them, when facts come out and shit, like, bro, a setup is crazy, bro. Y'all could, could, could literally tell y'all niggas right here, heart to heart. No. As soon as... As this shit is over with, as soon as I can get an update, I'm going to keep communicating to my lawyers. I'm going to say, yo, can I get an update? Can I get an update? Please, can I get an update? I will. I will. Okay? Let me make, let me see. Um, Yeah, it, R word. R-A-P-E. That's the whole thing about this. Um, For those who don't know. And, um, yeah. I'm not, um, thinking. Um, what's it called? Let me go ahead and say this. Um, I feel like I'm repeating myself. I know. Um, this. I already said I understand why people are jumping to conclusions because I wasn't responding. Um, I'm taking this very serious because my name is on this. Okay, my name is on this. And this is an empire I built from the ground up. And I'll be damned. I'll be fucking damned if my shit was to fall over right now, man. I'll be damned. And please, once again, do not hate on her, please. Do not go to her nothing, bro. She literally has every... She can feel however she want, bro. It's her perspective. She could feel however she want. Um, right now, I can't communicate. When I can't communicate. When I was told that. I, I was really told that nobody was supposed to be saying nothing because it's an open investigation and it's now like a case. Um, so like I I I almost told that. 
Also, um, I seen her uh, her tweet about um for all of Jiggy friends, um, and causing that fans threatening me, threatening to kill me. Um, fans, I can't speak for friends. I can. My friends haven't said anything. I can say that. My friends that I know, I'm not talking about the one who got accused or nothing like that. My friends that I know, everybody that I be around, Punga, everybody, everybody, everybody that y'all know who I'm associated with, they out of this. They don't know nothing. They, I haven't spoke to them. I haven't spoken to anybody. That's what I'm trying to say, gang. Why you follow his ugly ass? Because I have nothing to hide. I, I never deny he's not my friend. He's still being followed. Don't you think if I had unfollowed him, it would have been a little skeptical? Until facts come out. Until I'm hearing shit, bro. I'm on the same. That's what y'all understand. I'm on the same page as y'all, bro. I'm on the same page as y'all, bro. Yep. You feel me? <sighs> God damn. That was his response to the story. So tell me what y'all think in the comments below. This is a very serious thing. We don't really know nothing about the accused perspective aside from him being shocked. I don't know. I think that something did happen to that girl. You know, not that I don't know. I'm, you know, innocent to prove guilty, but I do think that what the girl said happened did happen. It's not right to try to bring Kai down for something he didn't do. But because he's a big name, he was automatically going to get more smoke than the person who actually did it. <sighs> but let me know what y'all think in the comments below. And we're going to keep covering this case. I'm going to go look into her interview that she did on whatever Twitch stream, whatever it was. I'm going to go find it. Appreciate y'all. Catch you on the next one. Phew. Be safe out here.